time now for another check of your forecast where yesterday was pretty nice today kind of on the gray side KJ and it looks like uh, things are kind of uh, gloomy into the night. That's the case, Jane, as we head throughout tonight, as you see it here, we do have winter weather advisory still in effect for at least the next half hour or so, especially for the mountains. We have ongoing showers there now, but those temperatures will eventually get near that freezing mark, so we could have some slippery road conditions overnight, so be mindful of the hazardous driving conditions. Also, the current temperatures for now are in the 40s and low 50s, but overnight, notice we're headed towards the freezing mark again for Boone. Rock Hill will be around 40, 41 overnight. Gastonia just beneath that 40 degree mark in the upper 30s by daybreak tomorrow. Most of us are dry, say, east of the I-40, I-85 corridor, especially to the south and east of Charlotte, but we do have the ongoing showers for the mountains and the foothills. It's not heavy rain, but we do have, say, those lighter showers out there coupled with the cold air, so it is a bit of a mess out there, especially for those of you dealing with the rainfall now. By tomorrow morning, it'll all be gone. We're looking at mainly clear conditions out there. Yes, there will be some areas of fog. We will have some lingering cloud cover. By and large, we will have a drier start to your work week and we'll have temperatures in the upper 30s to around 40 at daybreak. Tomorrow afternoon, the sunshine is back. We'll have sunny skies and temperatures are going to warm up into the mid 50s. So above average for your Monday, what a way to kick off the work week. Now, as we head towards your Tuesday morning, once again, we'll start off into the 30s and low 40s, but we will be a little colder by Tuesday morning. So be prepared to have those heavy coats back in rotation as we move into the middle of your week. But first, let's get through your Monday. This is what you're up against, and it's going to be a gorgeous one. We'll come in with mainly low cloud cover early on or limited cloud cover if I may, but then sunny skies into your afternoon and those temperatures will warm up into the mid 50s. In terms of rainfall, this is your last chance of rain until Thursday. So Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday primarily dry. Thursday we will have more widespread showers, certainly possible likely to move in later into the day and those rain chances will go up Thursday night into early Friday and the weekend is trending drier for those of you who have that extended holiday weekend coming up for MLK Day. The pick of the week is going to be tomorrow. Tomorrow, sunny skies, mid to upper 50s, above average. The warm up is coming back. And it's not just tomorrow. Your guy roof and seven day forecast shows 57 for your Monday, 59 near 60 by Tuesday, low 60s for Wednesday, and then mid 60s before the rain moves in on Thursday. And for the weekend, yes, it is going to be much colder, but it will be sunny as we'll have widespread sunshine, especially we'll need it as those temperatures dip into the 20s by Sunday morning. Oh.